Hi guys, um, so today I am officially 17 weeks and um, let's pretty much go over everything since my last video which was I think I was around 14 weeks. So a lot of big changes have happened this week. Sorry I'm sitting on my pillow on the floor <laughs> so my butt doesn't hurt. Um, I've been having a lot of different uh, symptoms, I could say. Um, my belly is getting bigger. That's one symptom. <laughs> um, I'm actually getting stretch marks, guys. I didn't think that I would get any because my mom didn't get any. Well, she got a couple, but, you know, they're like, they were like invisible practically. But, um, yeah, so I was just, you know, I've been taking care of my skin with my cocoa butter lotion and I've been using like two or three different types of lotions on my skin, aloe lotion and cocoa butter and stuff like that. And um, I've been putting it all over my belly and all over my back and all over my boobs. One thing I forgot is my butt. I know this might sound weird and might sound crazy, but I have more stretch marks on my butt. Actually, it's not on my whole butt, but it's actually um, the top of the butt. You know what I mean? Like really, really your lower 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 back you know what I mean and they're really red and I'm just like oh my gosh like oh my gosh <laughs> I didn't even know they were there my fiance had to tell me they were there like what is that you, you got scrap is that a scratch I'm like oh my gosh how embarrassing but um yeah I got my first stretch marks so it sucks but um I'm gonna definitely try to take care of that area more because that's one area that I missed <laughs> obviously that's the only stretch marks I have um another symptom is I've been having a lot of problems sleeping I even have um sleeping pills that my do doctor pro provided for me and um as soon as the pill kicks in you know my body relaxes and I'm ready to go to sleep but Right before that pill kicks in, I am going through hell just to be comfortable in the bed with my hubby. You know what I mean? And it sucks. It's just like lower back cramps and a lot of ligament pain, sharp stabbing pain. It just, it's, it's miserable. It really is. And um, I've been trying to lay in certain positions, you know, on, on my elbows and my knees, trying to, you know, relax the body and get off of my back and my butt, you know, um... If you guys have any suggestions on how to comfort yourself at nighttime just by, you know, relaxing in the bed, then I would definitely love to hear what you guys have to say. Um, <clears throat> my hair has definitely gotten longer. Um, it's actually touching my neck now. Um, I, ha I left it curly for like two or three weeks just to, you know, let it be natural and don't put anything in it. And I straightened it and I'm like... <gasps> It's touching my shoulder. <laughs> I was so happy. But anyway, these past couple weeks, besides the pain and the cramps at nighttime and the bloating, um, it's been actually pretty great. Um, as long as I keep taking, um, sometimes I take my, my vitamin B6. I haven't really been taking those. Um, honestly, I haven't really been taking my prenatals either because I have the gummies, excuse me. I have the gummy ones and they're just so nasty like when I first got them my whole first trimester I was just you know taking them well most of my first trimester and then I just I was like I cannot swallow it like I'll chew it chew it chew it and I can't swallow it so I have to find me another uh, prenatal vitamin if you guys also have a suggestion for a great prenatal vitamin that you can swallow please let me know because I really need one I need to start taking my prenatal vitamins um other than that, yeah, that's pretty much been my past two weeks. I haven't gotten anything as for baby buys yet besides, you know, the things that I showed you in my last video. Um, so that's pretty much it for these past couple weeks. Um, yeah, I think that's about it. Like, my skin is still very dry. Um, the most that you can do is put on lotion, layers and layers and layers of lotion. <laughs> pretty much the only thing you can do. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, 
Make sure you like my video, subscribe, and answer the questions. Don't forget to comment if you have anything to ask me. And um, I guess that'll be it. See you guys in another week or two. <laughs> Bye. Belly bump time. So, I'd like to give a shout out to my stepfather because he's the one that bought me this pretty... It's like long in the back, short in the front. I don't really know what to call it, but this is lace. And then underneath, it's just like a regular you know tank top and I love this even though I can't really button all the buttons <laughs> at the top but um yeah I like it there's no buttons down here so it can be open you know people can see my belly so anyway <laughs> um I can't really take this off because it's like a pin right here but um here is a side angle side view got my leggings on and uh, here is the, you know, with nothing on. Lower that. Still pretty little, 17 weeks, but you know, I'm I'm a little girl. You know what I mean? I'm I'm very petite. I only weigh. I, don't, I gained about two pounds this whole pregnancy. I only weigh like one. 17 now. <laughs> That's it. Also, one second. I keep forgetting that I can measure my belly. My hubby bought me a measurer. <laughs> measurer. So, let's see. When I first got pregnant, I was about 28 inches. Now I'm pretty sure. I don't know if you can see it, but... 31 and a half so yeah I'm getting up there <laughs> so that's about three and a half inches but um okay that's it guys hopefully I see you guys in a week or two I have an appointment this week so I'll give you some updates on that bye